Welcome back to another video of Activerse Universe. Today I'm gonna be going over the 2017 to 2020 banger. So as you guys can see right here is where I began kind of like my journey towards my dreadlock. And I have not twisted it or anything yet, but I started doing different hairstyles, different. I tried uh, cornrows, as you guys can see. I tried braids, I tried buns. I tried a lot of different things and that's why I recommend everybody to do. This is like a Travis Scott braid right there with some glasses on, you know what I'm saying? Looking sharp, looking clean. Uh, my hair type is four, I believe 4B. Um, and so it is nice to see uh, cornrows and uh, um, Travis Scott braid with those type of hair texture. And even, and even if we go to the threes, I think mostly uh braids will look nice but i look like travis scott already so caps i look like amine i know what y'all about to say amine or playboy cardi so this is 2018 uh, july uh this time is i think i started cutting more hair and stuff like that um i still i'm always still working at uh this place called uh, fries electronics and that's not my instagram anymore uh it used to be my old instagram but it's not anymore uh so i remember just growing my hair because i didn't have time much to do stuff to it like to actually get dreads so i was just like growing it and growing it and i started getting tired of it at the end of like 2018 and i uh was planning on getting dreads after a while and it was like pretty long like my hair was like long it doesn't look like it's long but you'll see me pull down my hair and you'll be like what in the world actually started doing my hair uh, he did it uh, in some lock or crochet needle and it came out pretty crispy uh, I can link the link in the description uh, so you guys can watch I think it's over a million views literally of that uh, that crochet needle and uh, he did it two days before my birthday and it's my birthday right there 27th of December Not just a dread transformation this is a whole hair transformation and you guys will see my hair going uh, short and then it goes pretty long after 2019 so every time you uh, do any type of hairstyle your hair looks like it's shrinking just like how you whenever you keep your hair in a bun or just let it go it just shrinks automatically you know it don't keep its full length and uh, with dreads actually it goes way shorter <laughs> That's why my hair looks very short, but it, trust me, it was not that short before that. It was actually pretty long. Uh, right here is like February, uh, two months into dreads. I think this is my two months update of my dreadlock. Um, and for some reason, man, I should have rocked it down uh, back then because my hair, like that length right there is like amazing. Like I loved it. It wasn't too much work. <laughs> Uh, but I kept it in a ponytail and I don't know why I did that. I'm kind of mad at myself that I, I used to keep it in a ponytail because it looks banger. that are wondering like if you guys want to see all my journeys from my hair dreads you guys can go into the playlist section uh, that I have 
and go to like the dread journey and i have it like literally month to month up to 16 month maybe i, f- I missed maybe a few months but yeah this is airport right here uh this is the time that i was uh um this is a time hold on when did i launch my youtube channel yeah i think that's the time around then that i launched my youtube channel um so i don't what i'm confused hold on last year april is when i launched the channel but i have footages that i took prior to that because i knew i was launching the channel so i had like seven videos literally ready ready to go this is when i graduated from life point christian university um and i was showing you i was showing people that how to like put dreads like put caps on the dreads or dreads on the cap cap on the cap on the dread yeah cap on the dread i think it's cape not cap <laughs> my fault um this is august this is when the disaster literally started happening i haven't had a retwist since the beginning of the year so it's been about eight months of not uh having no retwist and i think i watched it barely like three times and so i dealt with a lot of build-ups and right here literally you can see the whole thing clumped up almost like into one dread uh this is september of 2019 <laughs> i was trying to figure out what is going on with my dread uh and if you guys go look at uh i think eight months update or 10 months update i think it's 10 months update that i did you guys will see like how bad it is and this is when we rinse the acv rinse it and oh my god that water was dirty november is after i got a retwist gunther the great hooked me up with a retwist and look at that i took it off the braids that i had i had uh just like i guess a dread braid and uh man man oh man save my life man go watch that video too i i can link down in the description if you guys want to see that uh of my whole dreads coming from uh freeform to an actual section down locks Twenty twenty, man. This the best year so far. This the best year I've ever had. Uh, this is the beginning of the, the year. Right behind there is where it says "Hooray!" is actually my birthday for that uh, December, because December is my birthday, like I said. This is February, and uh, I'm actually uh, starting to like the half and half, man. And it kind of started to fade a little bit. I don't know if it's because it got dirty or the bleach stopped bleaching itself, I guess. I don't know. Maybe haven't seen the sun in a while because the sun does help bleach the bleach itself. And so, um, yeah, in April comes, I dyed it black because I got married. Uh, March, that's why you don't see the March thing because I, I don't think I did much in March because I was so busy with the wedding and stuff like that. But I dyed it black for my wedding. Uh, and so that's why you don't see that half and half anymore. But the next color, it will be coming at the end of the video. So stay tuned and uh, watch the rest of the video, man, and enjoy. videos that you guys see are, are taken away are taken out from uh the previous video that i already did so if you guys want to check that out check that out on my channel this is me recounting my dreads after i had a few congos going in uh because of the lack of free twist that i was getting but my dread looks healthy it doesn't look thin or anything except for the bottom part uh because that's the part you twist a lot more than any other this is when I put like a lot of jewelry in my hair. I think it's my first time that I put jewelry in my hair, to be honest with you. Before that, I think I might have like maybe one jewelry before, but that's when I put a lot of jewelry in it. A lot of people were rocking with it. But this is right here where I dried the blue. My blue came out so fabulous, man. Look at that. It looks so nice, man. And uh, if you guys have not watched that video, make sure you go watch the video. Link will be in the description. Make sure you get that to 10K likes so that I can go to my next dread color, which is going to be silver as requested.
thank you guys for watching this video. But till next time, keep acting the verse and creating your universe. Stay tuned.